Well, some of the earliest reports out of China showed that among COVID positive patients admitted to the hospital, as many as 40 or even 50 percent had evidence of some damage in the kidney. They had protein in the urine or blood in their urine. And 10% of them even had some decrease in kidney function. So we knew early on that the kidney was one of the targets. Kidney failures have become a global public health issue in the last few years, with every country having tens of thousands of kidney failures each year. Kidney failures can cause people extreme discomfort, pain, food restrictions, and even a need for dialysis. And in extreme cases, it can lead to a transplant or even death. While dialysis has been a good proven out method to treat kidney failures, it still involves poking people with needles and that's no fun and also is an invasive way to treat any disease. A less non-invasive way, in fact, would be a pill. This group of scientists designed a pill which was infused with a bacterial cocktail with strains from three different bacteria types obtained from the fecal microbiota. Did you understand any of that? Basically, they made a pill using your own poop. So the point of this pill was to break down food so that it would be less work for the kidneys in your body to do so. And that way, the broken down food could pass through the kidneys effortlessly. So this pill was made from a hydrogel-based material, which is basically the squishy long pills that you get in your local pharmacy. And of course, they use the whole technique of microfluidics with it. This is a huge advancement in medical technology in two fronts. Number one, this is a non-invasive way, which means that it doesn't involve any pricking and poking of needles. It's definitely better than the invasive dialysis method, which is currently being used. And secondly, because this pill uses your own poop, what this means is that you have a custom pill made right for your body to work for your body's needs. With that said, a lot of things are unanswered as to how this pill would affect a larger population, but this is a huge advancement in medical technology and I, I hope you guys enjoyed listening about it. If you did, give the video a thumbs up and don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys in the next video.